Hi everyone. For a geometric sequence, we're going to find the sum of the first 10 terms when our third term is 48 and our sixth term is 6. So we're going to let A and R be our um, first term in common ratio. So A is going to be the first term and R equal the common ratio. So let's solve for the common ratio. Uh, for uh, a sub 3, that is the same as a times r squared, right? Because if you have the first term is a, then the second term is a times r, because you have to keep multiplying by the common ratio, and then the third term would be a uh, times r again, so that would be r squared, right? And this equals 48. And our sixth term, similarly, will be a times r uh, five times, right? And this is going to equal six. Now let's call this equation one and this equation two. So if we subtract um, or divide, since we're doing ratios, two divided by one. So uh, equation two is a r to the power of 5 uh, equals 6, and we're dividing by 1. So that's going to be uh, a r squared divided by 48. And the a's cancel, you get r cubed equals 1 eighth. So basically, um, our r is going to equal 1 half. So I can write this as r cubed equals 1 divided by 2 cubed, right? Because that would be 1 eighth. So your common ratio is 1 half. If your common ratio is 1 half, uh, then you uh, substitute it back in and find your a. So let's just do this one. So if you substitute in a times 1 half squared equals 48, you're going to get a times uh, 1 fourth equals 48. So your first term, when you multiply 4 times 48, a is going to equal 192. So you just multiply uh, 4 times 48. So now we have our first term and our common ratio. Now using our formula for the first 10 terms, so our s sub 10 is going to be your first term times, and let's use this formula instead. These are both basically the same. It just depends on what order you want to go in. So let's do one first. So one minus your common ratio uh, to the power of n, our n is 10, all divided by one divided by one half, or one minus one half. Now this just equals one half. So basically, you're going to multiply this 2 uh, times uh, 192. That's going to give you uh, 384. And then you're going to have 1 minus 1 half to the power of 10. And this is your sum. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye-bye. <laughs>